can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven-foot Kareem at Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once. I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Bruce Lee enters the octagon with his mind set on one thing tonight, that UFC championship. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. All right, here's Bruce Lee getting ready for another UFC start as we begin round one. So fast, so quick, so good at setting up striking angles. And it's hard to simulate the speed in training. I know the opponent has talked a lot about trying to find training partners to simulate Bruce Lee. Easier said than done. Bruce Lee trying to get off to a good start tonight. Misses with the right hand. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, and he tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Got the single collar tie. Another good stick to the head. Nice kick, yep. Nicely timed kick to the body for the champion. Oh, you land, I land, is that what we're doing here? Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there, beautifully done by Lee. Over and over, this guy's getting hit right in his face. So once again, making good use of his size as he lands the knee. It's a pretty good jab. Lee gets absolutely melted by that head kick. Stay on him. Just over three minutes now to go. Good volume with the kicks, not just one minute. Nice body kick there. Another big body kick land. Gets to the single collar tie. Straight punch is true. Beautiful combination there. If you are teaching an up-and-coming fighter about throwing volume strikes effectively, you can do worse than watching the film on this I mean, guy it's tonight. a master class, John. It's a master class in mixing up the target, mixing up the... Oh! He's hurting bad here. Oh, now he lands a shot to the leg. He gets to the single collar tie. Look for him to keep that elbow tight and throw punches with his three hands. Oh, nice lead up and cut. He's got to start moving his head. He cannot take this many shots to the head. Deep now. Under two minutes here to go in round one. Man, his jab is good. There it is. Closes the gap and gets the single collar tie now. Oh, and yet another knee finds the target. So a huge moment here. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Well, lands a good series of kicks there, DC. It really didn't take him long to get a good beat on his opponent. He figured the timing, and now he's been driving kick after kick into his opponent. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. Can't take too many more of those. Oh, roundhouse kick. Oh, collar 
Tai. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are gonna take their toll as this fight goes on. Able to connect with a beautiful jab. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. Just misses with the straight right. Pretty interesting to see him mixing it up with the kicks here, some calf kicks, and now attacking the thigh effect. Just throwing a traditional leg kick. The traditional leg kick was a little higher. Everybody wants to talk about that calf kick right now. There's still a lot can be done with those traditional leg kicks. 10 seconds to go in the round. Now we take a look back at some of the highlights he has had his kicking game going early and often tonight. I mean, on point, right? He knew that this was going to be a way for him to take control of this fight. He's used those kicks to really put him out ahead. And I'm not sure if his opponent has the ability to adjust and stop him from landing these over and over. You ready to fight? Ready. Second round underway. All right, so as this next round gets underway, hopefully the good action we saw in the last round will continue. Both fighters certainly had their ups and downs, both got the offense going, but now we'll see if one fighter or the other can really take control of what has been a very close fight thus far. Beautiful jab there by the champ. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Misses again with a right punch. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Well, as we pull up the... Yeah, he's hurt really bad. Lee gets tagged by that stiff jab. I mean, over and over, he is taking these strikes to the head. Oh, that is a nasty inside leg kick, DC. It is a great technique, but it only takes one time to check it, right. and your night can be over. Or you can end up like Anderson Silva. Be careful. Got an issue? Here's a tissue. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body, and he hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following the game plan. The overhand left is true. Gets in close and gets that single collar tie locked in tight. Beautiful kick. All right, so he continues to land a high volume of strikes. He talked to us a lot about pace and pressure, and he has certainly kept up his end of the bargain. I mean, the cardio is fantastic tonight. He is pushing at a level that we have not seen him fight before. This is shades of Colby Covington, Max Holloway, those guys that can fight all night. He is showing you that he has done the work in the training room, and it's on full display tonight. Oh, big elbow. Tags him with that uppercut. Well, he has certainly kept the punch counters busy tonight. He's landed a ton of significant strikes and clearly is winning this fight tonight. He's winning this fight going away, and it's one of those rare instances where everything comes together. He gets to the single collar tie. Look for him to wear on his opponent by pulling the head down and punching with the free hand. Oh, he lands another debilitating strike to the body, and he continues to punish his opponent's midsection, had a lot of success with it in the previous round, and picking up exactly where he left off. Well, champ, I don't see that well, but it's hard to miss the redness underneath that elbow. A lot of bodily investment from his opponent tonight. Yeah, it's an investment. John, it may not pay dividends right now, but the more you go there, the more damage you do eventually, it will show itself. Right now, it's starting to show. Under two minutes now to go. Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Big 
Straight left. Come on, buddy, keep your hands up. Let's go. Oh, nice. Nice. Lee gets caught by that flush straight punch. Nice job by the offense there. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Well, a really good second round for him thus far. After a somewhat lackluster first round, he has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Oh, sidekick lands. Straight right hand now just misses. One minute to go in round two. Lands the overhand punch to the head. Certainly showing off some good hands here tonight. Strong kick there. Oh, looking to land the leg kick, but unable to find the target. Oh, the roundhouse kick lands. Taking a lot of body shots this round. Big punches. Well, a headhunter, he is not beautifully done as he attacks the body yet again. I mean, John, to have a guy live in a game plan and use it so effectively is very surprising. But with this guy, he's so smart. He's so disciplined. You kind of expect things out of the norm. Tonight, we see a body attack that we haven't seen in the octagon before. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC, and if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. You ready? You ready? Go. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. All right, here we go with the start of another round. Pretty good previous two rounds, I thought. Yeah, it's been a very competitive fight to this point. Both guys have had their moments, especially in these last two rounds. You expect somebody to get ahead, but they've both been so evenly matched. We're still right where we started. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. So there it is, taller fighter landing a knee to the body. Oh, nice straight left. That was a beautiful head kick. Hook lands. Well, as soon as he goes with that high guard, he pays for it to the body. You see the bruises really starting to accumulate now. In the beginning of the fight, you think, I gotta protect my head at all costs. Right now, I believe that this guy has to worry about his body. Look at how red the side of his body is. It has got to change something. Going back to his patented kicks here, but unable to find the target there. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Oh, slips and then rips him. How about the upper body movement there? I might let you kick the inside of my leg after the show. No. See how that feels. You don't want that, J.A. You do not want that. No one wants uh, that. Uh, Even trained professional fighters right. can't take too many of those strikes. Oh, is he opened up now? Nasty cut on the bridge of the nose. Nice high kick lands. Oh, Superman punch is good. So we have passed the midway point in the fight. Nice crack there. Oh, and 
he tags him with the straight. Beautifully placed there by Lee. Superman punch lands. Oh, pretty good technique as he lands the sidekick, DC. Real nice technique to land that sidekick. He did a great job of getting that leg up and then right to the target. All right, so now his body language really starting to change and the bruises starting to accumulate on that side. I mean, you're looking at it, right? When you can visibly see the damage on the body, you know that the work has been done. What a beautiful game plan put together by this team. Well, that combination's gonna test his chin nicely done. 90 seconds now to go in the round. Well, no feeling out process tonight. Both fighters invoking damage on the other side. Yes, we knew this would be very competitive. We knew that this was a tough fight. We knew that both guys would be very evenly matched in this fight. But we didn't expect to see this type of war between these two guys. Well, I think I can smell the blood at this point in time. That canvas didn't look like that a few fights ago. Blood is flowing from that cut with every passing strike. Every strike. And it burns. John, it burns so bad. When you get cut like that, every time a shot lands, it just burns. So this guy needs to try to find a way to not take and limit the damage he's taking to this cut. Easier said than that. Oh, picture perfect shot there, DC. And one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is gonna be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. Nice job to get inside and get the single collar tie. Oh, nice. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes in this round. Really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. Certainly have to be mindful that you don't gas out, but you gotta like the output on display here. That's three rounds. We're now headed to the championship rounds. All right, there's the horn. The round is over, but not before he was cut on his nose from the strikes in that round. Back to the stool. Cut man is in. Should be able to shut that cut and prevent it from becoming an issue moving forward. But, of course, as soon as he gets struck in that next round, it could open back up. All right, the truck has produced some replays from that previous round. Perhaps we can even isolate the strike that opened up that cut on the bridge of his nose. It's nasty, and it's in a bad spot because the reality is when you can't breathe through your nose, you start to open your mouth, but the blood is dripping down into your mouth. How is he going to breathe in order to have a chance to win this fight? All right, here's round four, fight schedule for five five-minute rounds. All right, here we go, fourth round of a possible five. And this is the time where fighters are really tested, right? Dig deep, lean on the heart. We'll see who has the other one. You feel pretty good in round number five. Round number four is the one that really does test the fighter. It really does test the metal of the guy inside of the octagon. Missed on the right hand. Guess the single collar tie now. And now Leather being thrown on both sides. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. You gotta do better than that defensively. All right, let's go. Wow, strong roundhouse kick there. Nice jab. Nice straight right lands. Right hand by the champ, yep. Oh, solid kick right there. Big inside kick. Oh, that cut on the nose really becoming a factor now. It's only getting worse. Pouring blood out here. There's the kick. Shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow up. Oh. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. 
Just over three minutes to go. Oh, nice jab, nice stick. Work. Oh, he's looking to set up that head kick. No good. Hands high, hands high. Beautiful left punch lands. More than one, more than one. Punches and oh, nice kick. He's sticking him over and over again. He's got his head popping back. We'll see if he can follow up. Oh, oh well, that cut is only getting worse, champ. I'm not sure if it's time to call in the ringside physician, but we got a bloody mess on our hands now. Yeah, bloody mess. This guy's almost unrecognizable. Uh, you look at you look at this guy, and you look at his toughness. And his toughness may be a problem right now because his opponent will not let off on him. He's going to continue to beat him up. Great job getting that punch to the target. Well, we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. As of right now, he's thinking more defensively, and he's doing a great job of not taking any damage. Back and forth we go. Oh, he's got the single collar locked in the clinch now. Clean left punch followed by the right. Missed with that attempt. Just out of range with that left hook. One minute now to go in round four of a possible five. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Big right hook there by the champ. Nice. Nicely done. What a great fight. Damage thrown out on both sides. Perhaps some bonus money coming the way of these two individuals at night 10. 50K, baby. Somebody's getting paid. These two guys are doing a great job in a fight. That is so competitive. That is so evenly matched. These two really will be proud of the effort that they have shown inside the octagon tonight. Right. Horn sounds for the end of round four. All right, there's the horn signifying the end of the round, and he heads back to the stool, and hopefully he can stay in this fight because that is a severe cut that he's dealing with right now. All right, and being told we've got some replays from the previous round, and it appears as though the cut on the bridge of the nose is getting worse by the minute. It's getting worse by the minute, and he's got an opponent in front of him that wants to target it. He wants to hit him on the nose over and over again. I wonder if every time he gets hit there, the blood goes down into the mouth, making it difficult to breathe. You ready to fight? Ready. Good. It is the fifth and final round. And there's that jab. Nice punch to the head. Another punch lands, and that gets a pop from the crowd. Sets up that leg kick beautifully. Push kick there to the body. Strong knee strike there. Another knee. Huge block there. Man, his sidekick is just killer. You saw it right there. He has a really good sidekick. He's so fast at doing that technique, and there is no tell when he attempts that certain strike. Oh, brilliant execution to land the roundhouse. Oh, nice. Oh, single collar tie here. Well, I'm not sure I've ever seen a referee call in a doctor for... Oh! Work pays 
takes off, lands the Superman punch flush. Leg kick lands. Yeah, he's got to. He's got to start check kicks. Massive elbow punch. Well, he is a tactician. He does not discriminate when it comes to his weapons. There's a side kick. That side kick can go to the legs or to the body. What a technique. Oh, man, that cut looks terrible. He's bleeding like crazy. I wouldn't be surprised if they stopped the fight with that cut at some point. Well, it didn't take him long to get a good read on his opponent. Another good series of kicks there. He thought the kicks would be the key tonight, and they sure have been. Nice body kick. All right, late in the fight now, he needs a finish, or he's gonna lose this fight tonight. We'll see if he goes for it. I mean, he's gotta pull out all the stops. There is no more strategy. There is no more time to try to set up a punch. You gotta just start letting everything fly. All the damage just continues to be inflicted. And with respect to the athletes, if this was a movie, I might just walk out. I don't need to see it anymore. I mean, I just don't need to see it. it, it it's to a point now where it's getting a bit uncomfortable. You have a fighter who's clearly outmatched, and his corner will not save him. This is crazy. Beautiful head kick lands for this guy. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. Nice job landing the double jab there, DC. I mean, you are definitely pressing that one. You love that one, <laughs> don't you? You love that jab. Oh, nice straight left there. Under two minutes now to go in the fight. Very nice outside leg kick by him there, DC. We'll see if he follows it up here. He's really driving his shin into his opponent's thigh, beating his leg up. Ooh, big shot lands. Nice jab. It is hard to hear ourselves on the headsets. This place is going crazy after one of the best fights of the year. Both on the line. Just really a sight to behold from minute one of this fight. Well, they told us. They both told us. Strap in. This is going to be one of the best fights you've ever seen, and boy, has it delivered. We have seen blood. We have seen heart. We have seen spirit. We have seen these two lay it on the line against each other. But hey, it takes two to tangle, and we had the two right guys in the octagon tonight to produce an instant classic. What a fight! Oh my goodness! Big power shot there. Oh, the Superman punch lands! Combinations here! Oh, crippling uppercut. Oh, nice body shot. 20 seconds to go in the fight. And that's, that's the danger in the engagement there. Push kick there to the body. Official decision is in, it resides with Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges scorecards for a decision. All three judges score this contest 50-45. Declaring the winner by unanimous decision. And still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. Bruce the Dragon Lee! Well, what else?